What you guys got another video here for you now the other day I made a video on how to get Windows 10 update for free and as you can see here we've got this little icon down here okay now we've learned how to register and reserve our copy of Windows 10 update but there is a few people that don't like that icon down there and they also don't want to upgrade to Windows 10 which is fine now what happens if your machine is not compatible and uh, you don't want Windows 10 at all and you want to stay with Windows 7 or Windows 8.1 or whatever it is that you're running okay and that's totally up to you it's your choice and I'm going to show you a couple of ways how to remove this so you don't have to look at it all the time okay so the first one is uh, we're going to go to the start button here and I'm running a Windows 7 machine here as you can see uh, we're going to go to control panel inside control panel you want to look at notif notification area icons click on this and in there you will see a GWX get Windows 10 and you can see show icon and notification you can actually remove this by putting the hide icon and notification in the box that's the first place you can go inside your task manager here if you go to start task manager inside here if you look you'll see the GWX and you can see that there and you can right click on this and end task and this will then remove that from the uh, taskbar down there as well now there's another way we can get rid of that completely and uh, what you want to do is remove the Windows update so you want to go down to the start button here then click control panel then we want to go into where it says programs and features inside here you want to go up to where it says view installed updates inside here you want to look for the KB3035583 you want to come up to the top right here pull this bar down and you want to look around here and you can see it here Microsoft Windows 257 yours might be different but you're looking for this one here and this is the actual update here if you remove this click on it once and then click uninstall this will remove that uh, notification from your system okay and also you can check here by the date it's the very latest date so if you want to get rid of that you can also do that now also it is inside your Windows directory and you can do that by looking on your C drive and going into Windows and inside here System32 want to come down now if you're on a 64-bit operating system you want to check in this syswell 64 okay and that's going to give you uh, the location inside here okay and what you're looking for let me just scroll this down and you can see it there GWX inside here this is where the file is okay and what you need to do here is you can either uh, right click and uh, rename this folder uh, and do that but I mean really just remove it from um, the uninstaller and from programs and features and that should be good to go but that's where it's located here if you're running on a 32-bit operating system it will be in the system 32 folder okay and that's just about it really there's a few other places you can do it from the registry and stuff like that there's no point going into that because I think that will cover it right there what we've done and if you've got any other problems you can always head over to me forums and post on there and I should be able to help you from there anyway I'm going to wrap this one up my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk hope this one helped you out guys if it did then hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button if you want to get notified when I upload new videos also if you've got any problems with your computers or any questions or video requests or any product reviews you want me to do then you can always head over to the forums and post on there and I'll do my best uh, to do those for you Anyway, thanks again for watching, thanks for your support, bye for now.